Yes guys, what's going on? Welcome back to the channel and to today's video. So today is a weekly outfit diary. Essentially, I decided to film myself every single day, show you guys what I wore, but also I've done this because it's a great way to give you some kind of outfit inspo as we transition into fall. Now, as always, I'll have everything linked in the description down below. And um, for reference, I'm 5'11". I'm sitting at around 183 to 85 pound currently. Um, but yeah, today guys, we're not messing about. We're gonna jump straight in and take a look at what I wore on Monday. guys so Monday I popped into town to do a little bit of shopping because I can't lie since moving to Manchester I've become even more addicted um but yeah to break the outfit down pants we were rocking these beauties these are the linen wide leg pants from Cos up from there sticking with Cos we had the knitted black vest over the top of that we had this beauty if you remember this from last fall is the black jacket or I guess shacket from Zara and then on foot we had the Asics Gel Cayano 14s an absolute favorite of mine and then just to kind of finish the outfit off we of course had the Cos crossbody bag. So Tuesday, I decided to keep it nice and cozy. It was a full admin day, but as I like to do sometimes, I decided to do this from my local coffee spot. So to break the outfit down, pants, we went with these beauties. These are the heavy kind of military cargoes from Abercrombie & Fitch. Absolutely love these. On top, we went with the weekday fleece as always make sure you size down probably two sizes i'm normally a large i had to go to down to a small for this so the weekday fleece and then on foot we again had the asics gel cayano 14s and then again we finished the outfit off with the cos crossbody bag So I'm not gonna lie, Wednesday guys, it was a full day at the desk working on future brand drops. But me and the missus decided to go on a little bit of a date night later on. So I thought I'd show you that outfit to kind of change things up. Uh, leg wear, we went with my all time favorites. These are the wide leg pants from Uniqlo from the women's section. And yes, the women's ones fit a million times better than the men's, so always go for that. Size up one size. Um, up from there, we went with the lightweight knit, which is from Arquette. And this is in a beautiful, beautiful brown color and absolutely love how this fits. On foot, we had the Russell and Bromley loafers. As you guys know, absolutely love these. And again, just to kind of finish the outfit off and bring it all together, we went with the Cos crossbody bag.
Okay, so I'm not gonna lie, Thursday genuinely felt like the first day of fall. It may not look it on the, on the footage, but it was freezing. But either way, Thursday was a content day. We were out shooting stuff for Instagram and I absolutely loved this kind of gray monochromatic fit. So to break it down, legwear, same beautiful wide leg pants from Uniqlo, the women's section, but this time in the gray colorway. Up from there, we had this really, really nice light gray knit, which is also from Arquette. And then layered over the top of that, we had this old, old favorite of all of ours. It is the kind of big, puffy, Michelin style or Michelin man style puffer jacket from ASOS. Had this literally like four years. Um, and then the Asics Gel Cayano 14s on foot. Okay, so Friday was actually a really exciting day because I went to view some offices or some studio spaces for my brand Studio Du Jour. So obviously it makes complete sense to be rocking the best fitting joggers on the market, maybe biased, but yeah, the best joggers on the market from my brand Studio Du Jour. Up from there, we again opted for the knitted black vest from Cos. Absolutely love this when it comes to layering underneath pieces and then over the top of that, the mother of all bomber jackets. This beauty is from Helia Emil, and I'd probably butchered the name, but absolutely love how that fits. And then down from there, on foot, this time we actually went with the black Adidas Sambas. <laughs> So Saturday was definitely one of my favorite looks. Super simple, but perfect, you know, for a simple day in town, grabbing coffee, getting a bit of shopping done. And to be honest, that's exactly what I'd done. So to break the outfit down, legwear, we went with the super wide Astro jeans from weekday. Up from there, we went with the beautiful light gray knit again from Arquette and then Footwear, we went with, I believe it was the um, Asics Gel Cayano 14s. And again, just to kind of bring the outfit together and finish it off, we had the crossbody bag from Cos. If you haven't already guessed, definitely one of my favorite bags. And then guys, that, that actually brings us to today, Sunday. So if you're watching this video the day it went live, then I'm filming this talking segment that same day, that morning. Um, so today, super chill, obviously film my outfit and then editing for the rest of the day. So to break that outfit down, as you've seen, legwear, I am gonna be wearing the green Abercrombie Cargos 
absolutely love these. Exactly the same as the brown ones, but obviously in the green colorway. On top, it is the black hoodie that I am wearing right now from my brand, Studio Du Jour. This is restocking on the 6th of October, Friday the 6th of October, 6 p.m. BST worldwide shipping alongside the black sweatshirt, the black joggers, the gray hoodie, gray sweatshirt, gray joggers, all restocking uh, Friday 6th of October at 6 p.m. BST. Um, so yeah, gray hoodie on top, down from there, super casual, super cozy. We of course went with the Birkenstock Bostons on foot. Oh, and uh, the studio du jour cap as well, because let's just say today is not the best of hair days. And there we have it guys. So that is my weekly outfit diary. Those were all the outfits that I wore throughout the week. Um, yeah, as always, let me know in the comment section down below what you thought of the video and which out of those seven outfits were you guys kind of vibing with the most? What was your favorite? Let me know in the comments down below. But yeah, guys, that is going to be it for this one. I hope you enjoyed it. If you did, as always, please give it a big thumbs up. Hit subscribe if you're new. Drop a comment down below. Go ahead and follow me on Instagram. It's basically a daily vlog and I will see you lot next Sunday. Peace.